I think Duane has elevated possibilities with his quest to find solutions to age-old problems. To take an old line business like Earth Moving and try to make innovations in it, I don't know of anybody else that does it. Duane has been a pioneer. He has led the way in applying technologies like GPS. When the technology wasn't really proven, when it wasn't as reliable as it is today, but was willing to apply it, to train his people how to use it, and to take a chance. The future of GPS technologies in the earth moving business is only just beginning. Duane has always been seeking out the latest in technologies, and he's taken the earth moving industry into the digital age. Uh, the passion he has for advancing the industry is unparalleled than anyone else I've seen. But the real benefit has been to the industry as we brought this technology to the marketplace. It's probably the best company I've ever worked for. Dwayne's up close and personal. He's with you every day. He spends a lot of time just talking to you, you know, teaching you and working through problems with you, helping you out. Mackinac Corporation's like a, a big family here. It's just a good group of people to work with. He always listens always open to new ideas. There's never a wrong way to do it, but there's always a better way. We've had, uh, and do have at the moment, a third generation employees. I'd like for our workers to be able to work at their job with dignity. And then when it comes to time to retire, I want them to retire with dignity. He is genuinely warm, he's affectionate, and he's, ge and he's generous with everyone, both in spirit and, in, and with uh, his success. We have been married for 47 years. We have two grown children and four beautiful granddaughters. He is so generous, kind, very loving, gives his grandchildren everything he can. The parents complain. I was raised on a farm. And my father bought one little bulldozer, and I liked to drive it. And um, I thought if I'd make $12, $15 an hour, I'd get rich. Uh, Duane has loved equipment since he was a boy, and the equipment modifications are his life. Was that 973? Yep. Looks like it's a boom with a little loose too, isn't it? Yeah. 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 He can tell you serial numbers and changes in machines, and now the machines are even more sophisticated, and it winds his watch even tighter to know about how these things work. I think a, a good adjective to describe my father would be gearhead. Everything fitting good? Somewhat. <laughs> He's, he's like the mad professor with equipment. <laughs> His competition never catches him because he never stays still. He just keeps going forward all the time. And they finally figured out that they need to do the same things he's doing. And then they, he's, he's not there anymore. He's moved on to something else. Every time you think you've found something that he doesn't know about, he's already been there a day or two before you. GPS technology will change the landscape of the future. GPS guided equipment makes good operators excellent because of the ability to see the job on screen in the, in the cab of the machine. It helps our clients because they can open the doors quicker and of course they can reduce their overall cost of the project. I mean our first experience was with a guy who's been in the business in, in, as an operator for over 50 years and he, within 15 minutes he was asking us to leave so he could play with it. And that's exciting when you see how that affects people. He has never been proprietary about anything that I know of where he's going to keep a secret. If I share some with them, they share back with me too. And if we don't have our competitors um, accept GPS, it's much more difficult for us to get it accepted. Just tells me that if I want to make more money, I, I need to be doing what he's doing. He just wants to share what he's learned because he's excited about learning. Well, welcome to our final class here. And, uh... Today we're going to actually be able to get out and uh, use the rovers and uh, some of the other things that we've been hearing about. We are blessed to have a university with such strong engineering backgrounds so close to our office. The reason we helped Iowa State University with the GPS, we have a lot of young engineers that they've been trained at Iowa State, but they hadn't been trained in GPS. I'm a small town kid from small town Iowa. My dad had older equipment, and uh, just being able to get the chance to get some hands-on activity is just an opportunity that I, I never would have had otherwise. Just gives me a step ahead, and I would like to thank you for that. Well, Duane, I'd like to congratulate you tonight. Congratulate you for a job very well done. As a leader in your community, 
a leader in the world. You have left a footprint that will last forever. And one word to describe this new technology with GPS, the word I think I'd think of is fantastic. Mac and Chesa at Hezzard Company song. Giant scrapers, soil compactors, dozers, backhoes, and rollers. Challenger tractors moving that black. I don't know the song. I must have been left out on that. We also have really cool hats and we have company afghans. I did not know that Dwayne's company has a song. And it's kind of a um, pop western theme. What is the song? <laughs> Tell you the truth, until today I'd kind of forgotten about it. I doubt if it'll hit the top top seller in Iowa, but we, we are pretty Mackinich around here and we don't care if anybody doesn't like that. We think it's cool. Oh, that's that's cool, you know. Big yellow.